What's up guys, the Panthers here, and welcome back to another FIFA 23 video. It is 6 p.m. It is Saturday. EA have given us a Centurions Foundations pack and a Centurions Essential pack. Contains 15 rare golds with three guaranteed to be 85 or over. All items untradeable. Contains 10 rare golds with three guaranteed to be 85 or higher. Tradable. We're obviously going to need some FIFA points for those, aren't we? Yes, we are. Give me that. 100 player pack. There's no 100 player pack. Not in the store anyway. We'll have a look what the SBCs are, mind you. All right, we'll start with the tradable one just in case we get dupes. Here we go. Centurion, English striker, Jamie Vardy. Let's go. Tradable as well. Kind of makes it worth it. Oh, yeah. We'll store him in the club as well. Why not? And then, and no, and then. And then, oh. Need to crack my neck. The untradeable version for just 800 FIFA points. What does this give us, EA? Walkout. German. Centimid. Tony. Oh, it's not Tony Kroos. It is finally. Ooh, yes. We get Hammers Milner in there as well. He's only worth like 35k, but still, man. Goretzka, Kostic, and Milner. You don't mind that, man. I'll tell you what. That was I've a couple been of nice little packs the right there. Best right. Team in FIFA days. Let's go and look at the, the first time objectives. Into a stream. There is nothing in objectives. Nothing in milestones. And so, S, B, C. What have we got? Nothing in swaps, obviously. Upgrades always empty. Icons, not today. Advanced, basic. Live. Here we go. What have we got? We have got Terrier Centurions. Four star, four star, six foot tall. Nest shot trait, flare trait, and flare passes. Good pace. Good, decent physicals. Dribbling's a bit meh. Passing's okay. Shooting's okay. I mean, it's a bit of a it's just a bit of a meh card. And that's why it only requires an 84 with a team in a week and an 83. There you go. I, I he's he's not not awful. Um, not awful. Centurion's Challenge 1. Marquee matchup still there. Centurion's Challenge 2 for a prime Electrum Players pack. 75 rated squad. 22 chemistry. Same league. Max 5. Countries or regions. Minimum 2. Nice and easy to put together. And then... 100 players upgrade. Oh, yeah. So it wasn't a store pack. But it was in the game. 100 player. Earn a pack containing 20. Oh, 20 rare silvers. Why would anyone care about that? Three segments. That. Is good value. No short. Oh, definite short. That's decent enough value. An 85 rated, an 84 rated, and an 83 rated for 80 golds. Trust me. Trust me, daddy. You guys are about to see, right? The 83 rated squad is like, what, 10k, right? We'll see. We'll see. The 83 rated squad, obviously... Not promo cards. What do you mean? That's an 85 rated squad. Perfect. That's the first team done. You get a jumbo gold pack back for that as well. Jumbo gold packs right now can actually have some good value. The silvers obviously are a bit of a pain. I get that. But in a game mode where we've now got access to just like loads of fodder. In a game in general where we've got access to loads of fodder. You get a pack back there, which isn't bad. Just got to be... Uh, maybe the Belgian manager sells, my bad. Um, the 85 rated... The, like, the 84 rated needs a team of the week. The 
But even then, I still don't think it's like too bad. We'll go for Nuno Santos. I oh, like listen, guys. I'm all for bashing EA for the sake of bashing EA, right? But on this instance and on this occasion, it's so easy to craft things now because of the Winter League upgrade SBC that's there. But it doesn't take much effort to get an 85, 84, 83 rated squad. Also, with all of the objectives, the gameplay objectives that are there, that draft thing that's there, that sort of stuff, it's so easy, like so easy to pick up fodder. To the point where, like, you could go and get Gulashi, right? And put him in this. We're going to get ourselves a gold there. A rare gold. Northern Forest kit's quite nice. But the 83 rated squad, obviously, is, like, super easy, right? It's literally 10k. The 84 rated squad with an inform. Probably, like, maybe, like, 35, 40k. Hold that statement until you open it. No, it, I, like for me, even if it's even if I don't get anything good out of this pack, I will still stand by the fact that I think that this is good value, or at least grindable. Maybe not good value, but grindable. It is undisputably grindable. Um, the eight three dirt cheap. The eight four is reg generally cheap, especially with the inform. The eight five people might stumble on, but even then, like eight five is like seven k, right? So. And you get a hundred player pack. Yes. Yes. It contains 20 silver rares. But let's see. This pack is so garbage. So garbage. This is such a scam pack. Ah. Uh. Oh, that's bad, isn't it? That is actually bad. Oh, I, I, <laughs> oh. It's grindable. And so they've got that going for them, which is nice. Oh, dear. It is grindable. It might not be the best pack in the world. But it is grindable. Um... Let's go and have a look at uh, Terrier. Ooh. It's like a dog joking, isn't it? Um, Terrier's already got a player in a month, though, hasn't he? What is it compared to his player of the month? It's barely an upgrade to his player of the month. Does have an upgrade on skill moves and does have some traits. No, it doesn't have any traits. Oh, yeah, it does. It has uh, the flare trait and an upgrade to skill moves. I think the best chem style here is an engine. Good vision, good crossing, good short passing, good curve. Great pace, decent dribbling stats with good dribbling. Alternatively, maybe a hunter, you know. If you can get him on full chem, and he's got striker availabilities as well. Four star, four star, six foot two, high medium work rates. He could be quite interesting, a striker. Could go finisher, boost up that agility and balance and dribbling. But yeah, finisher's not bad as well, to be fair. And may, and even then, maybe marksman too, to get that physicals up, get the reactions, ball control, dribbling up, and the shooting. I probably would go with marksman if I was playing with striker. But this card it is like, it, okay, it's only 46k or whatever, but it's a bit meh. It really is. It's barely better. And that's why it's downvoted. Barely better than his other card. And then this one's upvoted because even though it's a terrible pack... It's still like, you know, grindable on that. But uh, I think that's all of the content for today, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Damn, well, fair enough, guys. That is going to be the end of the video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to leave a like, rate, and comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And for now, guys, I'm out. Peace.